Hey, I'm happy to see you again on Busha Bush. This is Delphine. Today I show you how to spread correctly your sugar gum past on your cakes. <coughs> Yummy! To do it, you need the sugar gum past. You can make it uh, watching that recipe. Some flour to cover your work plan. And obviously your cakes. Step one, you need to cut the top of your cake to obtain something flat. Step two, you cover it with jam or honey or anything, something sticky. I will cover it with hazelnut spread. Step two, you spread some flour on your work plan. And you spread as much as possible your icing. Once it's done, you simply cover your cake with the icing. And you gently press it around your cake. Cut around, don't get too tight, then you put the extra icing under your cake. Well, here we go. If you need to superpose your cake, you should add some uh, wheat tooth path to make sure it stays in. I don't have it, so I will just put it that way. Now, because we want to do some decoration with the past, with the icing left, we will uh, color it. I will color it in blue. I won't malax it too much because I like the effect it has. You will see in the end. We get a large band. And the second one, same size. We fold the first one. We do three week run. It's very easy to do. Huh? Like that. Okay. We will put it on the top of the cake. So first part of the bowl. Second part, you cut a really rectangle. And you just put it onto your bowl. If you want it to stick well, uh, you need to add white eggs on it. Huh? There we go. You get two long bands with the shape of a bow in there. And you add it. And here is your super cute wedding cake or what you want. I hope you enjoyed my cake design and I'll see you later for a new video. Bye bye.